Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. Today we'll be reacting to The White Stag Education. Now these are decently long, so without further ado, let's just dive straight in. There's no captions. White Stag Education. Ein Baron's Hiking Safety. Created by Dan Se Sev, Sev, yeah, I'm great with names. In collaboration with Ocean C County Parks and Re Recreational, I'm pretty sure that's what that said, or Recreational. Hiking in the New Jersey's Pine, Pine Barrens can be a, a wonderful experience, but it is not without its dangers. This tape will teach you the safe method to, so you can safely travel the greatest trails on the East Coast. Oh yeah. This music. S. A. F. E. Safe. Stick to the trails. S. When hiking, it is important to stay on the right path. Following the trail uh, blazes will ensure you stick on the correct trail and do not get lost. A single rectangle means the path continues straight. I see. Rectangles forming a left diagonal indicate a left turn. Likewise, two rectangles f uh, forming a right diagonal and in uh, indicates a right turn. Shit's loud. As of 1968, it is federally uh, mandated that all trails must be blazed. Follow unmarked trails or trails with suspicious marks. You will not return. Oh, great. Yippee. You just won't return. A. Acquire equipment. On a hike, you should be prepared for any obstacle you may face. Use the checklist to acquire everything you need for a S-A-F-E hike. S-A-F-E hikers checklist. Food, water, hiking boots, weather appropriate clothing, first aid kits, compass, hiking knife, flashlight. A compass paired with a map will help when the intended path becomes unclear. You can find a map at your park's visitor center. F. Fear the forest. That's very odd. The masked people have been living in the Pine Barrens for hundreds of years now. An unholy entity holds d d demon d yeah over the woods. Their <laughs> oblation. Oh fuck! Such a great at reading words when recording. Argument is strength. They're strong. 
If you hear the whistling, you have stumbled upon a false trail. Oh my fucking god, that's terrifying. E. Evacuate. Ooh, ooh, ooh. No. I want to stay in the forest. Oh my fucking god. Oh my fucking god. <laughs> that actually got me. Thank you for watching Pine Barrens Hiking Safety. Stay safe out there. White Stag Education. Hell yeah. An After 10 production created by Stanley Cuts. This is this is Christmas Eve candlelight service with White Stag Education. Back at it again. Christmas Eve candlelight service. Hosted by Grandwood Church of the Pines. Presented by Pastor George Robertson. Recorded by Dan Se Sev and Luke Bale. Receive, I guess. Special thanks. Ida Sammons, Noah Emmers, Na Niava Nolan. What the fuck are these names? Edward. Ulwood, Nelson Laurel, Thomas Phillips. That's N Thomas Phillips? Oh, God. Christmas. Yes. Christmas is a time for people to come together. Friends, families, enemies, warring nations. To celebrate the great gift God has given us this day. His son, Jesus Christ. Yes. John 3.16 For God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten Son that whosoever believeth in him should not perish but have eternal life. Our Lord has given us creation and the opportunity to do with it as we wish. We have the choice to sin or to be faithful. Our Lord has given us his son to undo Eve and Adam's original sin. Jesus showed us that even with free will, we can live a life free of sin. Enoch 21.4 There too I beheld seven stars of heaven bound in it together, like great mountains and like a blazing fire. Uh. I exclaimed, for what species of crime have they been bound, and why have they been removed to this place? Then, Uriel, one of the holy angels who was with me and who conducted me, answered, Enoch. Wherefore dost thou ask? Wherefore reason with thyself and anxiously inquire? These are those of the stars which have transgressed the commandment of the Most High God and are here bound until the infinite number of the days of their crimes be completed. Okay. Lens error. Camera camcorder will the basement only door is over there. until restarted. I hate you so much. Be quiet. Shut the hell up, bro. Shut up. 
basement door open. I wonder what this is. Holy what the shit. fuck? Quiet. This will only take a second. What the hell is going on? Okay. That's its cry. Oh my fucking god. Shit! Fuck! Jesus Christ! Fuck! Yeah! Fuck. Indeed, very Fuck. fucked. Oh, fuck. Holy shit! No! 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 An after ten production screwed by Stanley Cuts. No, I. No! No, what the fuck was that? No! No, 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 no! This is in two in yeah, product information video. Health warning. White Stag Education Health Warning. The following informational video was not produced by White Stag Education. We have distributed restri this video uh for educational purposes only. The use of the in uh I'm not good with words. Pill and similar products is highly discouraged. Thank you for your cooperation. I really don't know what that says. We have domestic something pill. Well, something domestic pill. Over the past seven years, Genus Technologies has been developing a drug that high that heightens the accuracy of human foresight. Oh yeah. The drug has been named in Intuence Intuence and in Intuin in Intuition. <laughs> this informational video will analyze some of these uh, some of the tests and trials run by Genus Technologies and disclose potential side effects of the domestic pill. I'm not good with that fucking name. Test one, mouse and pitfall maze. Two, gra uh, two groups of 25 lab laboratory mice were placed in a pitfall maze with a piece of cheese on the opposite end. The mice in group two were each given a 50 milligram dose of into, into I'm just gonna call it intuence, while group one acted as the control group. Makes sense, makes sense. I had a lot of time to read this, I didn't have to pause, there was no sound either. Okay. Group 1. In the first group, uh, 0 of 25 mice successfully reached the cheese at the, at the other end of the maze. We observed uh, that the control mice preferred to take the direct route to the cheese and not make unnecessary turns, therefore falling victim to the pitfalls. Uh... Group 2. In the second group, 19 of the 25 mice successfully reached the cheese at the other end of the maze, making for a 76% success rate. Mice in the Intuance uh, yeah, group made turns to avoid the pitfalls even though the route was indirect. Conclusion Mice in group 1 followed their uh, natural instinct to take the most direct route possible leading them into the pitfalls. 
The 50 milligram dose of Indolence allowed the mice in group 2 to go against their natural instinct and reach the end of the pitfall maze. It's oddly quiet and I don't like it. Test 2, Human and Stoplight. That's not very good. Music's back. Two groups of 25 human test subjects were sat in front of a stoplight. Group 1 acted as the control group, while the test subjects in group 2 were each given 200mg doses of Indolence. Intuitants, it might be actually intuitants. It might actually just be intuitants. The test subjects were asked to verbally guess which color the stoplight would glow at random, and the accuracy of their guesses was recorded. Okay, this was a lot more friendly than I thought it was going to be. Out of 250 total guesses, Group 1 made 79 correct guesses, making for an approximated 31.6% correct rate. This is close to the expected 33.3% correct rate. Out of 250 total guesses, Group 2 made 250 correct guesses, making for a correct rate of 100%. What the hell? Conclusion. Test subjects in group 1 uh, relied uh, so solely on chance to predict what color the stoplight would glow, while the intu in intu intuition of the test subjects in group 2 was heightened by intuits, intuitants, intu yeah, allowing them to predict correctly every time. Potential side effects. These are gonna be fucking fucked, aren't they? Users of the Intuence domestic pills have reported having more vivid and lifelike dreams while asleep. These dreams can cause paranoic tendencies and insomnia. Paranoia. Genesis Technologies believe that the following two dreams were caused by Intuence's stimulation of the subconscious mind and may possibly depict future events. Oh, oh great. Margaret and Dalton's dream. Margaret's dream was about a never-before-television puppet show featuring the colorful puppets and a park ranger. She said the puppets she illustrated was named Rex. Rex, fuck. Mar 
Margaret stated that while in the dream, she felt like she had seen the program a hundred times before, despite it never existing. Strange. Henry Ledger's dream. In Henry's dream, he witnessed a meteor falling uh, towards the Earth. He watched the meteor crash near his home in Bar Bar Barnegat Township, New Jersey. I don't know what that says. I can't really see if that's an M or an RN. Or Benningit. Henry's dream has helped gen uh, genus Genus Technologies discover new comet now named Ledger's Comet. Huh. Very, very odd. Oh. Eh, perfectly fine. Daniel... Daniel Carpenter's dream. Those are those masked people in the woods from before. In, Di in Daniel's dream, he was standing in front of a group of masked humanoids. He recalled an immense amount of heat emanating from a large hole they surrounded. Daniel Carpenter's dream. Daniel transcribed the melody which he heard in his dream. Is that what we're listening to now? Because it's very, very eerie. Three days after his dream, Daniel had a violent encounter with three of the masked humanoids from his dream, however, he did not come across the large hole in the ground. Huh. Strange. Oh. Hmm. Thank you for watching this Indowins product, uh, product information video. Intuits, intuitions, intuits, 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 and scenes, intuits, and tans, intuitions, and dance, and lanterns. And after ten production, created by Stanley Cuts. This is Stranger Danger Puppet Show, White Stag Education. This is the longest one, 13 minutes and 21 seconds, and also the last one so far. White Stag Education. Forest Friends! Stranger Danger Special. Heard by Luke Bale and Dan Seaves. That's the fucking puppet from that one thing. This is the fucking puppet from that the last video. Oh, hi! I didn't see you there. I'm Rex. What's your name? <laughs> nice to meet you. Thank you. I can't wait to tell all the other forest friends about you. My they all would new know me. friend. Say, would you like to come camping with us? Sure. You would? Great! There's gonna be lots of fun activities, like hiking and fishing, and you'll even get to meet Ranger Luke. Oh, wow! No, I'm that so excited. Me. I have to get packed. I'll be right back. Alright, I don't need this. This could be useful, that? but no. 
that doesn't seem good to go camp camping with. Uh, I don't really like this thing. Oh, the fuck are you throwing weird. balls? Oh. Are these ball pit balls? Oh my god. There's a Red, knocking at the it's door. It's me, Anna! Huh? My Where's fucking god. Max? Why do you look like that? Wait. Who are you? I've never met you before. Yes, you have. All right, I'm ready to go camping. Oh, hey, Anna. <laughs> Meet my new friend. New friend? Rex, how do you know they're not a stranger? Well, I don't know. Maybe they are a stranger. But no. how can we know for sure? Let's go ask Ranger Luke. I'm he not. knows everything about stranger no, danger. Not. You're right. No, Come on, you're wrong. let's go camping. Nerd. <laughs> Why am I mean to these fucking puppets? <laughs> Calming music plays. Hell yeah. Forest. Also, this is really cool. This has great production value. I love this. Hello, Ranger. What, what was your name again? Ranger Luke. Luke. Rex and I are here. Hey, guys. Hi, Hi Ranger, Ranger Luke. Luke. <laughs> you guys are just in time to set up camp. Anna and I have a very important question. Alrighty, Rex. What is it? I met someone this is really new today. Well made. And they seem really nice and great, but I don't know if they're a stranger or not. This is a great production value. They're actual puppets well, too. This is great. They certainly don't look like a stranger to me. Hi. I'm Ranger Luke. It's a pleasure to meet you. Yay! What a relief! Yeah, I'm so glad that I found an honest and true friend like you, and not a stranger. Say, do you guys remember the ways to spot a stranger? Well, um... Not really. That's alright. We'll learn together with our new friend. Yay! Yay! Remember that story from way back when? Damn! If you can't recall, let me tell it again. This is the story Holy of fuck. Little Red. When Red Riding Hood? Yeah. Was sick in her bed. She stayed focused while walking the trail. I was not expecting a song. Holy fuck. Every single detail. It's that whole. Holy fuck, I love this. This is so well made, what the hell? This is a story of the park too. This is so fucking good. This was so good starting off. Holy shit, this has so much production value. For an analog horror. Hell yeah. This is great. This is a very beautiful park. I, this is real, I assume. 
like an actual place. Forest friends. All right. We have more. This hike is so much fun, Gleason. I agree, Oswald. But I'm exhausted from all this walking. Hey, hey uh, do you know where we are? Hmm. The oldest tree in the forest should be coming up soon. Well, how do you know that, Oswald? Huh. I feel like we've been walking forever. Well, Gleason, we've been following the trailblazers, so we'll be okay. Oh, oh no, oh no, oh no, we forgot to use a map. Are we on a false trail? Uh-oh, yeah, they fucking are. It's okay. Do you hear the melody? That means the strangers aren't hunting. Well, as long as we stand still and be quiet, we'll be okay. Yeah, hopefully. What the fuck is going on? What the hell? Hello, oh, the fuck? and welcome to Mr. Mr. Dungus's Dungus. Game of the Day. <laughs> Oh my fucking Today, god, don't do that. We are gonna be playing Spot the Stranger! I don't like that noise. Come on, let's go! This is so good. Both of them. Both of them. Both of them. Both of them. Easy peasy. I think it's right there. No way! Oh my god, I love the circles. This makes it ten times better. <laughs> oh my god, I actually almost didn't see that first. I'm not even fucking with you. <sighs> adversary. The adversary? No, I cannot spot. Oh, I think I fucking did. It's right there. <laughs> it witness it. Rot Ruth. Yeah, I great English. Beneath the, f the fuck. Yes. Is it like a big snake thing then, based off of. Thank you oh, for playing it. Mr. Gungus' game of the day! <laughs> See you next time! Oh, alright. Oh, they made it. The sun is set. The day is These old. fucking puppets have feet. we can't rest until our stories, stories are told. Now's the time of the night where we gather around the campfire and talk about everything we did today. This is really well made and I'm loving it. So, Rex and Anna, what did you guys do today? Oh, oh, oh! Today, we went fishing! Yeah, it Sounds was a nice. lot of fun. I caught a whole lot of fish today. I think I caught the most. You may have caught the most, but I caught the biggest fish. Yeah, right. Well, what kinds of fish did you find? We caught some black banded sunfish, creek chub Hell suckers, yeah. and even largemouth bass. We would have caught more, but we I ran out of worms. Well, that sounds like a whole lot of fun, even if you did run out of worms. Yeah, we'll definitely remember to pack more for next time. I want to go fishing. Gleason and Oswald. I've been fishing in a while. What did you guys do today? We went hiking. Yeah. Well, that didn't sound too enthusiastic. Did I you guys think have fun? we know what happened. Well, we were trying to find the oldest tree in the forest, but we got lost. And before we even knew it. It was too late. We heard the strangers whistling. What did it sound like? It was a song. 
And what did you do? He stopped, stayed quiet, and when we couldn't hear the song anymore, he turned around. Great job, Gleason and Oswald. Hell yeah, great job, now, I guess. I guess that's how you survive What would you have done if it wasn't a song they were whistling? We would have closed our eyes and ran away. Great job! Hooray! Oh my fucking god, Always why remember, did you look like that? Strangers have Ranger no regard Luke. for your well-being. They aren't like us. Do not follow them into the woods, no matter how friendly they look. See you on another yeah, episode like you. of... Yeah, like you! Fucking god, you're terrifying over there! Oh, oh so there's people behind you. Found In memory of Grandwood Flower Ryan Rex. <gasps> no! What? No! No fucking way! What? The actual fuck? Yeah. No fucking... Is there anything at the end of this? No, just white stag education. No goddamn way. Alright, well, thank you guys so much for watching. Now, before I actually close this video, I would like to say a few things first. At a 2.5k subscribers, I will do a face reveal. And if you want more, join the Discord, which will be in the comments. Same with the channel and playlist link for what I've reacted to. But anyways, thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.